Just last night at TAM, Local 2 Investigates introduced you to a recent crime trend with an old name. They call it jugging. Police say career criminals target people at banks, following them and waiting for the right time to strike. New tonight, we are hearing from a man who says that he was jugged right after leaving his bank. Local 2 Investigator Joel Eisenbaum is in Northwest Houston tonight with a story you'll see only on 2. I'm you. You've just popped out of a bank. You've got your money in your pocket or maybe your purse. Your foot loose, fancy free, about to get in your car. No problem, right? Only there is a problem. I've been watching you, and now I'm about to follow you. He's a man of steel. Brawny Tony Williams recycles metal for a living. But a couple of recent crimes have really tested his metal. Each time they hit me, it was for in excess of $1,000. Totally, they got me for $3,300. Twice, Williams has been followed from a northeast side bank, his car broken into, and his hard-earned money stolen. They just follow you. They follow you, and, and if they get you, they get you. It's the numbers game. If they don't get you, they'll go back to the bank and wait on somebody else and follow them until they get somebody, until they're successful. This problem is citywide. These guys go all over the city, every bank. It's a... Uh... It's, a, it's all over. It's called jugging. You pick a target exiting a bank or ATM, follow them anywhere, then find just the right moment to either rob them or break into their car to get the cash. I don't do that stuff, man. I get money my way, man. Police say two men, 22-year-old Canavius Dorsey and 24-year-old Prince Woods, jug for a living. HPD's Northeast Side Tactical Unit tracked them down Wednesday, and Williams immediately recognized the car they were driving. The same one he thinks followed him. They're opportunists. They just take the opportunity to catch you if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Those two suspects, Dorsey and Woods, are in jail tonight. Bond is pending. So far, they're each charged with one count of felony theft. On the northwest side, Joe Eisenbaum, KPRC, Local 2.